Okay. Hello, friend. I'm here in Springfield in front of the Moxie Theater. I'm going to go see a movie called A Man Called Ove. It's based off of a bestseller. I think it's a Swedish movie. I'm with my mom. My mom is visiting for Thanksgiving, and she read the book and said it's a really good book. So I'm excited to see the movie. It's always good to be a smart person and go see smart people movies. Um, we stopped and had pho at Hong Yen, and there's an Asian market by there. And I was inspired by my friend Andy Cook's food to try a funky soda. And so I got this basil seed drink with watermelon flavoring. And it has little floaty seeds in it, as you can see. It has a... Um, it has a ring on it, kind of like my favorite energy drink, Bomba, where you pull the ring kind of like a grenade or something to open it up. And so I got it open, let me give it a try. Oh wow, it's really tasty, but it has a really bizarre consistency and texture because of the floaties. It's like drinking a liquid gelatin or something, but it tastes like watermelon and it tastes really good. You can kind of chew the seeds a little bit. And it's really tasty, I really enjoy it. Looking forward to seeing this movie. Stick around and I'll tell you what I think. Hello, I just got back from seeing a man called, it looks like it's spelled Ove, but I think it's actually Uve, is how it's pronounced in Swedish. And uh, it was a really good movie, the kind of good like art house movie that is just about people and their lives and their emotions and feelings. And it was about a, grouchy like old cantankerous man who uh, his wife was dead and um, a lot of it involved him trying to commit suicide which was kind of sad because that's always a really rough subject and uh, but he was really funny the way he was grouchy and calling everybody idiots and then things get better for him and uh, he makes a friend when this family of immigrants move across the street from him. And uh, it was a really touching movie. I cried quite a bit. It made me feel um, pretty sad, but also like kind of bittersweet. Uh, I really like movies about old people and I love art movies and foreign movies. And uh, I think they're really uh, help you become a better person and everything as opposed to just kind of some of the garbage movies that we all watch that don't really teach you anything. Um, it's I highly recommend this movie. I'd say definitely check it out and please comment, like, and subscribe. Thanks for watching. Bye.